Hey guys, welcome to another video. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you my latest project. Um, I'm now, you've probably already seen in the thumbnail actually, but I'm now the proud owner of a 1952 um, split screen Morris Minor. Uh, it's a Series MM Morris Minor, so it's the, the early one with the, I think they call it the cheese grater grill. And um, yeah, there's not too many of these early ones around now, I believe. But um, this, uh, I've owned a few Morris Miners before actually. I've owned a couple of split screens and a couple of later ones. I've also owned a Morris Miner van many moons ago, uh, amongst other classic cars, but I haven't had a classic car for about 30 years. So I'm really, really pleased to get back into uh, owning a classic and uh, doing some work on this one and getting it back on the road. Um, it's in quite good shape. Uh, the, uh, the, the previous owner sadly passed away and I purchased the car off of his son. Um, it, uh, from what I understand, it hasn't been on the road for about five years. Um, it has, for the, for the past MOTs that it had, sort of going back for sort of six years or so prior to it coming off the road, um, it had only done around about a thousand miles and all of those MOTs were actually straight passes. So that gives you some idea of, uh, of the condition of what the car was like when it was on the road. Uh, underneath, structurally, it, uh, it seems to be in very, very good shape. Um, it's in need, it's in desperate need of some paint works. Uh, the, the paint's sort of crazed and cracking uh, in lots of different places. Um, fortunately, not much rust visible, so hopefully it's going to be quite a, a straightforward job to get it all uh, flatted back, primed, prepared and painted, which uh, I'm really, really looking forward to doing. Uh, the car has had quite a few little modifications along the way, although it looks very original, it's not that original. Um, there are certain things that have changed, for example, the, the engine is... Um, is no longer the side valve unit that it would have had originally. It's got an overhead valve unit in it, which um, which seems to have uh, come from a Austin A40 Mark II. It's the 1098 high compression engine. Um, the guy has done all sorts of weird and wonderful things to it, which um, previously, which you will, which you will see as we go through. But yeah, it's in pretty good shape. I'm really, really pleased. I'm so ex excited to get started with it. Um, I'm in the process of having a new garage roof fitted. So at the moment, um, it sort of sat outside on the drive. Uh, it was delivered, um, I think last week or the week before. Um, I was going to drive it home, but it had uh, it had a leaking radiator, a leaking top hose, and also uh, the brakes were all a bit stuck on, obviously. So uh, the decision was made to get it recovered home. And there it sat really for the last week or two. Uh, once the garage is sorted, which is imminent, I've got a new roof going on the garage and um, I've cleared, cleared out loads of rubbish from the garage. The car will be going inside and work will commence. Now, it's gonna be um, a little bit of a restoration. There are also some modifications I want to do on the car. Um, and I want to sort of try and keep it sort of fairly original looking as original as it can be with um with obviously all the different things that have uh, that have gone on beforehand but uh, we will go through those as and when the time comes um but yeah i'm just really looking forward to getting stuck into it and getting this lovely old classic back on the road um yeah like i say we will go through all the bits and pieces in uh, in in sort of upcoming videos but um, just wanted to introduce you to the car, show you what, uh, what the project is going to be, and um, hopefully we get stuck in very soon and get this old girl back on the road. All the best, thanks ever so much for watching. Um, if you want to follow the videos in this series, please hit the subscribe button, and uh, I will be long very soon with another video, and we can get cracking on, uh, on getting the Morris back on the road. All the best now. Thanks a lot. See you soon. Bye.